The program you're about to see is made possible through the financial support of people like you. We hope you'll join the thousands of people who make our programming possible. Become an In the Life member by clicking on the Donate Now button on our website. I'm Greta Olaf's daughter. I'm Susan Mosca. I'm a the documentary. documentary filmmaking team that brought us the Brandon Tina story in 1998 now explores the meaning of the word marriage with the film Edie and Thea, A Very Long Engagement. This tender double portrait received a six minute standing ovation when it premiered at the Frameline Film Festival. Holland. No, Venice? 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 Venice, yes. Oh God, this is one miserable person. Good. <laughs> and you're not so happy either. Good. Good. I think I'll look at this picture for an hour while everybody has lunch. <laughs> we met Edie and Thea through Brendan Fay, who runs Civil Marriage Trails, which is an organization that helps gay and lesbian couples go to Canada to get married. He was simply determined he had just arranged our marriage. That is to say, he had introduced us to the judge, and they were just going to interview us as a favor to Brendan. Those ladies, they really grow on you. Once you meet them, it's really hard to, you know, there was no way we were not going to do something about them. It was easy to talk to them, but, but as, the, as we worked with them, we really did fall in love with, I mean, our, this couple fell in love with that couple. So it was so easy. We stopped being self-conscious in any way. And it's just like we were just telling our friends about our life. When was it about 1962? I suddenly couldn't take it anymore. And I called an old friend of mine, a very good friend, and I said, if you know where the lesbians go, please take me. OK. So she took me to the Portofino for dinner. The lesbians used to go there on Friday night. And somebody brought Thea over and introduced her. And we ended up dancing. And we immediately just fit. Our bodies fit. And we danced the whole night through, as the song goes, such that at the end of it, Edie had danced a whole through the bottom of her, her stockings. stockings. <laughs> and that was the beginning of it. What we learned about aging from Edie and Thea and maintaining a relationship and staying in love was very much about the word engagement and having, I mean, a very long engagement. It's not just about a wedding ring, but it's about being engaged and being interested. I always wanted to get married, and, uh, and well, Thea is the one who, who proposed. As time went on, it began, it began to be possible in some places. Now, therefore, I, Harvey Brownstone, judge of the Ontario Court of Justice, by virtue of the power vested in me under the Marriage Act of Ontario, do hereby pronounce you, Edith Windsor and Thea Spire, to be legally married spouses and partners for life. Congratulations. <laughs> This is a film that needs to be seen by people who are putting themselves on that pedestal and being against gay marriage. Why should it be different if you've lived with somebody as if, you know, certainly not feeling single for all those years? You know, what, what's the big deal if it's not financial and, and economic? And the big deal is something symbolic, uh, okay, having to do with this, this somehow worldwide recognition of the word. The film for me is like a gorgeous gift to me, okay? This woman that I adored is, is talking to me every day if I want, you know, saying her vows. Usually people do this because they're making a commitment, as they say, at the beginning of their lives. For us, it's at the other end. We premiered the film at Frameline. It was uh, really a tremendous experience. Edie had a um, six and a, always six minute standing ovation. I don't think there was a dry eye in the 
auditorium. People kept stopping to, you know, could I hug you, please? Uh, I gotta ask to autograph somebody. And it was the relationship that they were talking about. It's exactly how I would want people to see us.